how far will I go for Rome? Well, we will see about it after I master enough men and conquer all of the Iberia. Hello guys and welcome back to my Lepidus campaign. I'm mastering my army and planning a huge attack on on, on, on Cantabri and then making a defensive wall against Octavian's room and preparing to capture the North Africa my public order is going down so I should work on it the biggest problem actually is the difference in a culture but you can see that Latin culture is rising quite fast 4% per turn it will slower down after it reaches the, the balance that it needs you can see that Latin have 11 of influence while nomadic have 5 so that's around 60% Latin culture needed to reach that balance let's move those army this army backwards so I can master more units and I can also move this dignitary up over here to watch for the public order and speed up the Romanization of the province I can end my turn I can end my turn can I? Uh, look how many I'm paying a really a lot of for upkeep of those legionaries here maybe I could disband them since I don't need them but I want to keep them in a reserve since I'm in a war against Pompey yeah I will keep them and will move my navy here as a support and ending the turn Maori wants a non-aggression pact, of course I will refuse it, thanks for the offer guys, but you will be gone, our hidden agent exposed, research complete and spy increases in rank, so let's level him up and select another technology, champions should be useful so we'll research that tech and time to master more men more legionaries and some velites troubled populace where here really Alright, let's uh, level up those settlement capitals that will rise the growth of the whole province. Since I have uh, enough food, there is no need in upgrading farms at this moment. Let's check out the growth. If you mouse over your food surplus, you will see that you have maximum of plus 5 growth per turn from food that's the maximum amount and you reach it after you have food surplus of 20 so everything beyond 20 food surplus is uh, not mm, should not be your priority let's call it that way after you reach 20 food surplus you are quite fine with food so you can prioritize something else for example a Latin culture or public order buildings military army I should definitely build some siege engines uh, 
Are they attacking me again? Is this another battle coming? Uh, another dignitary increases in rank. As I already said in a previous recording, for dignitaries I like to combine authority skill of course, but also add some cunning later. Uh, let's go with let's go with philosophy plus three to Latin influence. Ready, willing, as you command. Let's now check out the public order indeed. from characters plus six. Yeah, I need more shrines. I need more shrines, but I also should. Let's see where it is dropping fast. This this here is minus fifty four. No, let's let I, I must move my focus to Hispania province. Uh, seal settlement, farming settlement, or market settlement. Farming settlement. You can see that each of those buildings in a chain gives you bonus to growth and they are quite useful. Same with the province capitals. Manipular barracks. No, I need to prioritize shrines. Let's build one in Taraco. Shrine of Jupiter. Build one here, and I can oh end God. another turn. How may I serve you? Unhappy populace, swear or declared Antony's Rome fighting Pompey. I have some kind of advantage. This is only my garrison army. I even have a veteran leg legionnaires. Ooh, 480 men fighting their levels and vigilance. I have a huge advantage. I could easily out resolve this. But let's fight it on a field. Let's fight this battle on a field. Let's do it. Quick save, just as always. Although I have advantage. But I like to quick save every time I'm doing battles. The only reason why I'm doing that is because sometimes I'm not satisfied with my commentary. English is not my native language and I need some time to find the right words for what I want to say. And sometimes I got messed up. So I, I need to reload if I'm not satisfied with the commentary. But all right, uh, we are fighting the Battle of Hadrumentum, 440 BC. We are in a quite small settlement. My army is ready. As I said, I even have some veteran legionnaires waiting for the enemy to come. My levy skirmishers are ready. To do the fight, maybe I should get closer and try to shoot them while they are still at the bay. Get closer with my legionnaires and plebs, plebs. I even have some naval vessels. We'll try to skirmish those guys if I can, of course. I'm not sure I will succeed, but all right. Let's try to shoot those guys. What do we have here? What type of unit is this? It's a general. Take aim! Romans ready for duty! 
Whoa! Bam! Who? One of our ships has been boarded. Our general is under attack. And it seems like... Am I winning this fight or losing or what? Move out. Support ship at your command. I won this battle already. Ramming was successful. Oh, pull Our back, pull back. Pull back, you fools. Time for a charge. I mean, enemy army is much stronger than mine, and it's quite strange how when out resolving how my chances were so high. Alright, row hard and try to hit those guys here. Straight into the back. Bam! And they are down. I could do that with all those ships while they were. Oh. My levies are facing the wrong direction. Our men flee the field of battle. Oh man. Come on, ram those guys here. Move, 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 move. Ram. Boink. <laughs> oh man. This was really simple. I could do it to all those guys while they were still on the ships. Look at this. I'm, I'm winning already. Already. Whoa! They have really low morale. 21, 21. Whoa, man. I could kill them while they was on the ships. Uh, I didn't have to record this, but alright. I did. For glory. For glory. The battle is turning in our favor. And that would be it. Victory! Ah, nothing extra to watch. Sorry, guys. I just wasted four minutes of your life. I'm definitely killing those captives. Pompeys don't have so many friends, as I could see from diplomacy screen. Trade agreement dissolved. Research complete. Spy increases in rank. Again. Mm, let's go with cunning again. Try to something. See the percentage for succession, poison provisions, now let's wait a little bit for the rest of my army to complete the recruitment, recruit units, Herding ground and farm. A good combination. And time for another technology. Oh, this would be fine. Plus 5% morale and enables the building of practice fields. Uh, I need a few more turns for this province to expand. So 
I can build a siege engines ending the turn quite a lot of different things to micromanage in start but once you organize your provinces and you must know what you have inside you must uh, you must go through every single province that you have and do the upgrades and learn about what, what buildings you have what buildings you need and after that your life will be much easier trust me uh, another non-aggression pact offer man you must cancel another time rejected yeah your life will be much more easier after you learn what you have and what you need my recommendation to you is to go with combination of public order buildings rising the latin culture by romanization edict by shrines and try on the other side working on your economy building up some farms building up the settlement capitals and things like that my dignitary increases in rank no i didn't want to die i wanted to take authority but all right i can upgrade the province here but i don't have enough cash at this moment i should work on a public order maybe i can turn off the taxes let's see how much income will i lose only 200 it's not much Uh, auditorium plus two public order pen per turn and 80 wealth from entertainment we'll take it of course and let's level up those farms herding ground no 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 it will lower my public orders i will wait i will wait a bit more i will wait a bit more i need to stabilize my public order first Stands none. All right, everything is going fine. I will build. No, 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 no. That's the same province. I have more cash for the recruitment. Quite a lot of legionaries. Some cavalry would be welcome and probably some siege engines I think I can attack now what does they have Iberian slingers skirmishers let's recruit more Velites and that will be it I will hire some mercenary cavalry this is the army that I will attack with but let's let's move closer to the border Ready for you have so I have enough movement points next turn when I want to declare men. war Rome needs good fighters. three four five six seven all right I will probably disband them later something like this construction complete Tarakao is bothering me but I can see that next turn I will be able to expand that province also alright let's end the turn and next turn we are declaring our first war Anton is wrong I'm not sure what they are doing I must be careful don't want to fight too many Romans at the same time there military access no friends. guys sorry and they demand 100s from me no are you crazy 
man, you're crazy. Military acts, look at this, same thing. No, man. Sorry. By the way, by the way, oh yeah, I forgot. I'm recording a Hearts to Fire on 3, guys. Hey, I have, I have released already four recordings. You can find them on my channel. I'm sure that Total War players are interested in that type of games. If you like it, I'm sure you can learn a lot from it. You can find that playlist on my channel. I'm sure you will enjoy watching. Faction destroyed. Troubled populace, where? Baetica. Baetica, yeah, I need to improve my public order, I already know that. Alright, I can't turn off the taxes here because it's quite quite rich province. And you have a positive public order finally. Whoa. That's good. Latin culture is rising really fast. Mm, building squal or cultural differences. Alright, positive public order. That's because I have turned off the taxes. Can I bring them back now? Let's try. No, oh, I will keep it off for a turn or two. And time to declare war. Hidden agent exposed. Let's move this navy here. I will definitely try to build a good navy in this campaign because I didn't play a lot of naval battles but I will try to do it this time and time for um, it's time for a war poison wells 86% chances it was successful and now I can declare my first war Yeah, that's it, guys. It's done. All right, another battle. This time, Barbar is, of course, in my favor again. But enemy also have something to show. They have one thousand men. I have one hundred and one thousand and one hundred. So let's quick save, just as always. And I will see you there. Thank you for watching, guys. And bye-bye.